I had another one, man, long. She was good people, good people. You know, that's when you know, that's when you be wrong. See, when you mature, you don't treat women like that no more. You know, all of us used to do that stupid shit, immature shit. She was ugly. I hate to use the word ugly. She wasn't so attractive. But she were good people. You know, she had a patch on her eye, you know. You know, the ugly people treat you right, though. They treat you nice. And, I, you know, she said, Bernie, why you always come over to the house late? 12 o'clock, 1 o'clock in the morning. You know, I said, they, you know, I be getting off work late, you know. She said, but you work days, you know. I said, you know, I be, I be doing things, you know, for the family and stuff. So I, I did feel kind of bad. So I said, I said, I'm going to take her out and show my appreciation because she would do anything for me, right? So I took her to the restaurant. So I called a friend of mine who had a restaurant. I made sure they was closed. I told him to hold it open. So it was just her and I, we sitting in the restaurant, and I was short of dough, but I knew he was going to take care of me. You know, I had the salad, she had the soup. You know, the soup was piping hot, she was good people, you know. So we sitting at the table, she put the patch on her forehead to give her, no, she was good people, man, she was good people, you know. So she was eating the soup, and the steam of the soup was getting in her eye, you know. I didn't know it, you know, no, she was good people, though, you know. So her eye accidentally fell in the soup. I didn't know it. I didn't know it. I swear, I cleft her Lord, I didn't know it. So when we went and got a hotel room and everything, you know, she didn't know she accidentally ate the eye, you know. So we went and got a hotel room, you know, we in the bed kissing and hugging, hugging and kissing. I'm sucking on her neck, kissing on her breasts, just working myself towards her, you know, her privacy, you know. And she said she got nervous. No, Mac, I, I don't want to do it. No, I don't want to do it. I said, well, if you don't want to do it, you know, I ain't going to force you. I said, but just relax, let me try it one more time. Relax, I ain't gonna hurt you, I'm gonna be gentle. You know, so I had to start over, cause she fucked up my momentum, you know. <laughs> so, I'm sucking on her neck again, kissing on her breasts, get down to her secret, you know. She jumped up again. No, I don't feel like it, and I'm getting angry now. I said, look here, help, I spent a lot of money out here. <laughs> Sit your punk ass down now. <laughs> fuck all that, you good people, but fuck that, you know. So she's laid back down, man. I had to start all fucking over. So I'm kissing on her neck again, sucking on her breasts. I got down towards, you know, the privacy, you know. All that jumping back and forth she was doing made her eye roll down. No, so when I got down towards the privacy, her eye was looking dead at me. I said, this motherfucker don't trust no goddamn body. 